In this video I will set up an Avado Rocket Pool node. I have already installed a package from the Dapp Store, so I can go straight to the package wizard. There are some prerequisites before I can get started, which are a fully synchronized Ethereum node, a fully synchronized beacon chain node, and an Ethereum wallet with 16 ETH plus some gas. And I also need a minimum amount of RPL to stake. Currently, the minimum is 154 RPL. I already prepared everything here for this video. If we take a look at our MetaMask account, I have an account with 16 ETH and also 160 RPL, which is what I'm going to stake here. My chain is fully synchronized, so let's get started. First, I need to initialize my hot wallet. I need to provide a node password for this. So I just enter a strong password and click init wallet. Now I need to download a backup of this wallet. We strongly recommend this, because you might need it later on to restore a backup. After I save this wallet, I continue to the next step. Now I need to fund my hot wallet. I need to send my RPL and 16 ETH plus some more for paying the gas. I will be sending 16.4 ETH in total. I can copy the address by clicking the icon and use that address in my MetaMask. I paste the hot wallet address and I'm going to send the RPL first. The minimum stake is 154, but I'm going to send 160 RPL. You can choose any value between the minimum and the maximum that is displayed in the wizard. I confirm this transaction and I wait. Now that is done, I will send the 16 ETH plus the gas also to the same wallet. So I go ahead and copy the address again. Go to my MetaMask, send to this address, select ETH and send 16.4 ETH. Now that the ETH is sent to the wallet, when I refresh my balance in the wizard, it will automatically jump to the next step, which is to register my node. Now I need to register my node, which is as simple as pressing the button register node. Note that this transaction will take place from our hot wallet, so we will not need to confirm this in MetaMask, because the Rocket Pool package will sign this for us through the hot wallet. Next step is to set my withdrawal address. Because by default all the rewards are sent to my hot wallet, and I don't want this, since the private key of it is stored on my Avado. That's why the wizard asks me to provide another address that I control as a withdrawal address, so that all the staking rewards in RPL will be sent to that specific address. I'm going to use the original wallet that I used to fund my hot wallet as a withdrawal address. That way I'm sure that if my Avado gets hacked or stolen, nobody can access those funds and those rewards. I type in the address and then I just need to press yes because the node will sign this himself through the hot wallet. I'll wait for this transaction to complete and then I can go to the next and final step which is to add the mini pool. Adding the mini pool involves three steps. In the first step I will need to give permission to the node to access the 160 RPL that I sent to my hot wallet. We just need to press yes here. There is no MetaMask involved in this step, because he signs this transaction himself. The second step is to actually stake my RPL. The wizard will stake any RPL that's in the hot wallet. Since I sent 160 RPL to this wallet, it will automatically stake the 160. Let's wait for this transaction to complete. The third step is to deposit my 16 ETH and create a mini pool, which is done in one transaction. I click the button deposit 16 ETH and create the mini pool. Again this transaction will be signed by our hot wallet, so no MetaMask pop-up will show up. Alright, it's done. 
Now before we go to the status page, we can download a backup of the whole Rocket Pool configuration, which is highly recommended. If you ever want to restore your notes, then you can do this through this backup. So go ahead and download the backup. Now I can go to the status page, which shows me different things about how my mini pool is doing. On top I have the note status, which displays information on the hot wallet and the mini pool status. As you can see there is a mini pool address, which is a smart contract on the ETH1 chain. I can click it and it will open the details on Ether scan. Validator was also created and I can see its pub key right here. When I click on it, it will go to the Beacon Chain Explorer and I can see that there's already a deposit of 16 ETH into that validator. In about 12 hours, Rocket Pool will deposit the other 16 ETH needed to start the validator. All I need to do now is to wait for this to complete and our validator will be up and running. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next tutorial video. Bye bye!